Well, the Brooklyn Nets have lost in the second round of the playoffs. Who saw that coming? Not many people. You know why? Because they were the predicted favorites to win the championship and they lost in the second round of the box. I told you, I couldn't pick who was going to win get this series. I didn't. I couldn't. I couldn't pick it. Either way, today we're doing a Brooklyn Nets rebuild, realistic rebuild, uh, if you guys are wondering. So, you know, not a lot of crazy moves are going to be happening in this video. If you are new, be sure to subscribe. It will mean a lot. Like the video as well if you haven't already and let's get into it, shall we? Today's going to be short, sharp, and shiny. Let's go. So, as a realistic rebuild, right? I'm going to try and get ourselves a better starting center. And I'm okay with Joe Harris starting at the three for this first season, I think. I like Joe Harris, but yes, he that man is getting paid a lot of money. So we might be moving on from him. But DeAndre Jordan for sure is going to be moved. We're also going to probably pair DeAndre with Spencer to try and get ourselves a better starting center. So if we go DeAndre Jordan and Spencer Dinwiddie, uh, we can get ourselves Yusuf Nurkic. I don't see, see that happening one bit. Uh, we're looking. We can get Montrez Harrell from the Lakers. The Lakers do need a point guard, if they're, especially if they're giving us a Dennis Schroeder. Uh, they get DeAndre Jordan. I think this is a fair deal. We're going to go here. Trade with the Lakers. Get ourselves Montres Harrell as our starting center for this season. Uh, then Dennis Schroeder can be our backup point guard for this se season as well. So that should work out nicely. So we have a Irving Harden, Harris, Durant, and Harrell starting five. We then have Dee Schroeder off the bench with Bruce Brown, Blake Griffin, Nick Claxton, and Jeff Green. We got two centers off of our bench what we could do for this first season right is hear me out send nick claxton down the g league he's got two years on his deal if we send him down the g league blake griffin we're probably going to want a lot of money next year won't come back this year nick claxton is going to be developing for us which is what we'd like to see and that way jeff green can get in the rotation as well so i'm fine with this team for this first season we're going to go durant Harden and Irving. Uh, we're going to run a four-star balance system, and this Brooklyn Nets side is projected to be the eighth best team in the NBA. Don't ask me how, but we'll simulate this first season, see what goes down, shall we? Well, we go 62 and 20. LeBron wins MVP. Lamelo, Precious, Giannis, Jar, Steve Nash wins all those awards. Cool beans. We do finish as a one seed. What do you expect? We put together a goddamn great team. Uh, Harden dropped almost 37 and 10 a night. Durant dropped 20. 25, almost 10 and 6.3. Irving, 22, 4 and 7.6. Trez dropped 15, 9.5. Like, we've absolutely killed it this year, boys. We absolutely smashed it. Offensively, we're the best team. Defensively, we were... We do need to work on our defense a little bit, but our offense is just so good. We're still the best team in the NBA differential-wise. So first round here against the Cleveland Cavaliers as a sweep. We now got the Hawks in the second round, which is a six-game sweep. And we're taking on our old rival, the Milwaukee Bucks. Watch us lose in six. I'm saying six games is an NNL. Okay, we're up 3-0. We win in five, and we've got the six-seeded Grizzlies. Very interesting, who have added Vucevic. Very, very interesting. Game one is a W. Game two is a W. Game three is a... Uh, it's also an L. It's an L. It's an L. It's an L. Game four is a dub. And then game five is also a dub. And we have won an NBA championship. Well, we're going to try and win another one, I suppose. <laughs> Lottery, I know for sure we definitely do not have a... Uh, what? What? Okay, I don't know why we had that pick, but uh, apparently we did. But we have the 12th overall pick, so that's okay. We have the 12th overall pick somehow. Don't ask us how we got it, but we have that somehow. The 12th overall pick, if we use that plus the 30th with, say, well, I mean, we don't need to get rid of Joe Harris, but we need to improve our team somehow, and there's really not a lot that I really want to do. We'll go to the draft and see what's up. We pick up Jalen Johnson at that 12th overall pick and Terrence Shannon with the 30th overall pick, so that's pretty cool. Trez has declined his player option, which I kind of expected him to do because he's going to want a lot of money this free agency. And we've actually got bird rights on him, Griffin, and Schroeder. So, yeah, why not bring back Montrez Harrell? Blake Griffin, sure, we'll give a bit of money to, and uh, Dennis Schroeder. I mean, if, if sure, if Dennis wants to come back, 
sure. I'm not. I'm gonna 100% take him back. That's for sure. Uh, do we have any good players here that we want? Not really. So we're just gonna go over here. So we no longer need Blake Griffin. So we could potentially trade Terence Shannon and Blake Griffin away to try and get ourselves someone maybe a little bit better. You know what? I'm gonna do this on Yoko Kongu and Cam Reddish deal. Uh, why not, I suppose? It gives us a little bit of youth, some players that we can maybe build around. Uh, I'm all right with Dennis Schroeder as our backup point guard still. And there's no point changing that. So we've got Durant, Harden, Irving, uh, Harrell, Okongwu. So we've just got a better backup center now, which means we don't need Nick Claxton. Sadly, because we got an Onyeko Okongwu. I prefer a Kongwu over Claxton, so I'm going to probably trade Claxton. We have one training camp, which we're going to go big man defense to Montrez Harrell, just maybe improve his defense a little bit. Um, but besides from that, we're going to run probably the exact same starting five. Or, or, hear me out, we trade Claxton and Harris for a better starting small forward. And you know what I did just see? I did just see Tobias Harris. We have to go up Dennis Schroeder in that deal, though. But yeah, Maxi, Tyrese Maxi in, in that deal, though. You know what? Stuff it. Let's go all in on offense. We don't need to worry about defense. Look, Watch our offense go crazy. Um, I prefer KD uh, at the three than Tobias, I think. Yeah, I prefer KD. Um, but besides from that, I'm going to run this team how it is right now. We have Maxi, Brown, Reddish, Okongwu, Harold, Durant, Harris, Harden, and Irving. Uh, Durant, Harden, Irving are our scoring options. We've got a four-star balance system, and the Nets are the projected 11th seed after just winning a champion. Right, okay, sure, 2K. Embiid wins himself MVP. Uh, we do go 68 and 14, if you guys are wondering. Um, we get coach of the year because, you know, we were the best team in the league. Just going to stick that out there. Like I said, number one seed. That's us. Number one seed, Brooklyn Nets. We've won championships. KD, we had three players over 23 points per game. We had Tobias with 16, Montrez with 14, and then Okongwu with 10. Beautiful. Offensively, it was good. Our defense actually caught up this year, and yeah, we smashed it. We absolutely killed it. We got the Bucks in the first round. Clean sweep. In the second round, we got Philly. who win the championship with Embiid winning finals MVP. Interesting. Interesting indeed. We lost in the second round of the play to the Sixers. Interesting. That's all I've got to say. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you guys all so much for watching. If you guys have enjoyed, be sure to leave a like. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Let me know down in the comments of any rebuilds you'd like to see in the future. I can get around to potentially doing them. So let me know down in the comments down below. I would like to apologize for yesterday's video. I'm sorry. Hopefully the music better in this one than it was in yesterday's. Um, but yeah, that's really going to do it. Like, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.